You know what, y'all? I'm going to bust a move. I'm going to make a banana cream pie. How about that? Because I got this graham cracker crust that I was going to do another sweet potato pie in. But you know what? These bananas are ripe. They're perfectly ripe. I thought, you know what? Let me use this and make a banana cream pie. It's almost like um, making banana pudding. You're just not putting Nilla wafers in there. So let's get going. It's so simple. It's so simple. It's so simple. Tri-City Singers. I am God. All right, y'all. I it just was moved on my heart. You know, I thought, you know what? I'm going to Harris Teeter and pick my mama up some Just Because flowers. Amen. Just Because. So that's where we're going into Harris Teeter. Just Because. <laughs> okay, y'all. This is a cute little flower I got from my mom. Isn't that cute? Cute, cute, cute. All right, y'all, we're going in on the pie. Tony, say hi. Hello. Y'all, this pie is excellent. You need to try it. Okay. Absolutely okay. excellent. Family approved. I feed up the day. Ladies, what you got to say? Outfit of the day. Ladies, what you got to say? It's John Jack. So, I love this. This is really cute. Is this what's in y'all? These colors? These like tie dye colors? Okay, this week it's gonna be brownies for dessert this week I'm craving them simple as one two three box mix mix it in a bowl you're good to go
Hey y'all, it's lunch time and I'm gonna just do um some lo mein. I got some leftover uh, spaghetti noodles. I'm gonna put some of that in there. I'm gonna use some leftover sauce from my sweet and sour chicken. Cut up the rest of this onion. And I'm gonna put some mushroom sauce in it. Pepper, onion powder, and give it a little heat with this two times spicy hot chicken sauce. I'm just gonna whip it together. I'm not gonna, it's not like a tutorial, just something for y'all to watch. So, y'all, this week, I didn't even share with y'all my planner. This week is gonna be like anything goes, but I'm watching the calories. But it's gonna be an anything goes type of week, whatever I feel. Um, I still have my planner as my standby, as my standby, but it's going to be more like, you know, Hey, this is just what I'm feeling. You know, this is just what I'm feeling. Not going to stick to a script per se. All right, y'all, let's get it going. In other words, this week is going to be a week of leftovers because I got leftovers in the freezer. So we're going to do like a repeat from four weeks ago, almost with a little new things here and there. It's time to cover and well you know what let me go ahead and put this hot this heat in here so it'll be cooking in there and you don't need but a little bit probably not even a half a teaspoon because I don't want it to be too hot but just enough of a kick to make me say oh I feel you I feel you all right now let it cover for a couple of minutes and then add the noodles All right, y'all, let's add these noodles. Oh my goodness, that is good, y'all. All that flavor. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm going to turn this on low. Oh yeah, that's perfect. I'm going to turn this on low. Of course, cover it back up for about another five minutes just so the heat noodles will heat up. Because you don't want to cook overcook the noodles because they're already cooked. And baby, I'm going to fix me a plate for lunch. And then I'll probably eat some more for dinner. And that's it. I, I'm done cooking for the day, y'all. I'm done cooking for today. <laughs> OMG y'all Oh, when I tell y'all, it's absolutely beautiful out here. <gasps> oh, 
the sun is going to be out for three days. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and then it's going to rain the weekend, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. But <laughs> until that happens, oh, my tree cutting service will be here on Thursday to, you know, set up and assess to go ahead on and start cutting the trees down. I want them down. I do, I do. And uh, they're saying that I may not have to count down all of them, but I just as well if they're you know if they're already out here, cause listen, you have to get in where you can fit in. I want to get myself on that schedule, cause I mean they have been busy. So. I'm excited about that. Get the trees down, then I can start working on my landscaping. And that's the other thing I need to do. I need to call a landscaper because I just want to have everything leveled and flat in the back. And like I said, I'm moving it up a little bit, but I, you know, I got to. I got to get it in where I can fit it in. But um, I'm here to tell y'all this land is saturated it really is but anyway with the trees gone like I said now more grass will grow back there but yeah I got to call around and when you but what what I'm interested in I want to get a landscaper that does good drainage so you know when they're doing your stuff they, they they're doing it where they understand the drainage they understand um just understand all of that because i sort of sit up sit up on the incline and the hill so when they're leveling things out you know i still want the water to you know when it the off run when it rains and stuff um, it rains down properly, runs down properly, I should say, because I've already got some inter interchange, interchangeable drainages already in my backyard. I got two. Well, when it rains, there's a, a drain that goes down underground and comes out in the front here, down and, and ton funnels over there to that creek in the back over there where those trees are. So... And so, I gotta have good folks come through here to do that. But, yep, I can sit out here all day and rock. But, in about 20 more minutes, I gotta sign back on. But, oh my goodness. Love, love, love. That little stir fry was good, y'all. It was yummy. It was quick. I put that together in 10 minutes. About 10, 15 minutes. That's one good thing about leftovers. You know what I mean? Everything is already highly flavored. You can still tweak it the way you want to. And that's the beauty of cooking. Look, y'all. Cook how you want to, you know? It's going in your mouth through your digestive system you know and that's how you learn different flavors what you like what go together what go together are we boyfriend and girlfriend do we go together <laughs> but anyway y'all i'm just sitting out here enjoying the countryness like i said i love living in the country I live out here in rural America, but I like living in the neighborhood. I really do. Some people, you know, would like five acres so they can do their four-wheeler. And that's that has its place. That's fun for people who like that. But I'm just going to tell you the truth, honey. I know I can call on Jesus. Jesus on the main line. 
tell them what you want. But let me tell you something. If you're good now, when you live in a neighborhood around peace for neighbors, and when some go to the left and you need to get to someone quick, you got neighbors on either side and one or two in front of you, honey, I need to be able to call somebody, honey. If I need some help, honey, you know, when your family and all them can't get to you real quick and that popo and all that there, <laughs> the Lord will put some people in your midst. And I'm so glad that we all as neighbors, we get along wonderful. Now, I'm closest, of course, to the neighbor across the street right in front of me. And uh, matter of fact, my neighbors in the back came over and introduced herself uh, the other day. I thought that was nice. You know. Yep. We're, 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 like I said, honey, we all here. Everybody in the, in, in, in the South ain't ugly, you know. But I'm so glad God planted me right here where he needed me to be. But, um, yeah, all is well, y'all, all is well. But anyway, it's just been what, look, I'm going to be real busy this week, too. So, y'all know how I do. I like to keep y'all updated. Um, I've been on the telephone, jaw jacking with friends and family. Spending time with friends and family, stuff like that. But, um... All is all is well. All is well. I, I'm glad that things are getting better for those people in Texas too. You know. Oh my God, y'all! I do not want to go back inside. Oh, this is what I live for. This way, it's 65 degrees, y'all. 65 degrees in this nice breeze. Oh, love it. Rick and them back there playing in the backyard. They ain't up here in the front. And I'm going I'm to have a little talk with them. I'm going to let them know, you know. I'm going to have a little talk with them and let them know that uh, some of them trees back there is... You know, I gotta... <laughs> y'all have a good productive week i don't want to say what day it is because you never know when i post stuff but anyway uh i'll be checking back in with y'all and posting up let y'all know what i'm eating and but you know what y'all i ain't lose no weight last week none it's like my body was like uh no but so that's what happens you lose weight i lost 15 pounds then i lost two and a half pounds and then I lost one pound. And then last week, it was like, no. No, no. So my body's like plateauing. So that's why this week I'm doing Anything Goes um, along with my walking. Um, so I can, I, it's Anything Goes, but I'm monitoring, monitoring, monitoring. So it'll be a different things I eat are gonna be like uh, a lot of fruits and vegetables, the meal replacement shakes, which I love. I need to order some more. Those are excellent. Oh, 
with that banana in it. Oh, and then the other day for lunch yesterday, I had a chocolate uh, probiotic shake and I cut up a half a banana. Oh, y'all saw. Oh, that was so good. Oh, or did I show? Have I showed y'all that? I don't think I did a video on that. I didn't because I was working and I had to, I had a bunch of stuff going on, a lot of issues. So, but anyway, let me get. I feel like y'all just sitting right out here on the porch with me, and I'm just like y'all jacking. But anyway, y'all. But sometimes it's it's good to you know just get away. And just let your mind focus on nature for a minute. And then you just get on back to what you need to get on back to, right? Get on back to what you need to get back to. Get on back to what you need to get back to. Yes, sir. All right, y'all. Love y'all. And I will see y'all on the next video. Love you. I appreciate your support. Toodles. And the reason why I ain't on camera today, y'all, is because I'm like, I'm I'm house ready, not camera ready. <laughs> Alright, y'all, bye. <laughs>